Hey guys, I get requests for this video pretty much daily, so let's do it. This is an absolute value equation. The way absolute values work, if you have the absolute value of negative five, it outputs five, and if you have the absolute value of positive five, it also outputs positive five. Since this x is equal to an absolute value, we know that it must be greater than or equal to zero. And then we can update these to specifically be about x. If we have the absolute value of negative x, it'll output x, or if we have the absolute value of x, it'll output x. To move forward, we're going to use both of these facts. So for the first one, we need the stuff inside the absolute value to be equal to x, and that's this right here. And for the second one, we need the stuff inside the absolute value to be equal to negative x. That's this equation right here. So in order to solve this equation, we need to solve both of these equations. So for this one up here, let's subtract x from both sides. In order to subtract these, they need to have a common denominator. So I'm going to rewrite this negative 1x as a negative 117 over 117x. And now when we subtract them, it'll have a denominator of 117. And 163 minus 117 is 46. And we can bring this down, and x minus x is equal to 0. Next, let's add this thing to both sides. So we end up with 46 over 117x equals 64,440 over 39. Then we can multiply both sides by this reciprocal and we get x equal to 6440 times 117 is 753,480 and 39 times 46 is 1794. And this divided by this gives us 420. And that is our first answer for x. On this bottom one, if we add x to both sides, first we need to give them a common denominator of 117, and our answer will have a denominator of 117. 163 plus 117 is 280. And then we can bring this down, and negative x plus x is equal to 0. We can add this fraction to both sides, so we end up with 280 over 117x is equal to 6440 over 39. We can multiply both sides by the reciprocal, and on the left-hand side, we just have x. And on the right-hand side, 6440 times 1,753,480. Seven and in the denominator, 39 times 280 is equal to 10,920. After we do this divided by this, we get 69. And that is the second answer to our question. So for this absolute value equation, x equals 420 or 69. How exciting.